welcome everyone to another episode of Bryce Side. Tonight we are going to be going to Helston to go to Buku's to go get a burger. Now they do really good burgers, so we are going to take you along with us so that you can see what they do. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. But first, I need to change from this t-shirt into another. Da -da, da -da. Oh, that wasn't quite right. Okay, let's um, <laughs> let's try that again. Maybe a, a a better snap of the fingers. Perfect. Nice. Hey Tilly, are you looking forward to a burger tonight? Yeah. Is it going to be delicious? Shall we go check it out? All right. Let's go check it out. journey was all too much for AJ. All too much, hey eh, kiddo? And we made it to Buku's. Right opposite the Rodney Inn. Okay, so we made it at our table. I do quite like it in here, don't you? Yes, we've only so. we've eaten out of here a couple of times, but we've only eaten in once, haven't we? Uh, that was when I was pregnant with Tilly. Yeah, that's right. So that was a little while ago. I wasn't just a little bit pregnant. You were very like, pregnant, weren't you? It was your birthday, so I was about. Oh yeah. I was about thirty-six weeks pregnant. Yeah, that's right. All right. So, kiddos, on the kids' menu, you can have just a plain burger. A cheesy burger, uh, bacon and cheese, bacon, cheese, and onion rings, um, bacon, cheese, onion rings, and bar uh, pulled pork, or a pulled pork burger, or a chicken burger. What are you thinking, AJ? Yeah. And they do hot dogs and grilled cheese sandwiches as well. All right. Okay, I think AJ's going with a hot dog. What about you, Tilly? <laughs> nuggets, chicken nuggets. Right, so basically every type of burger you can think of, cheddar cheesy, squeezy and cheese, flaming jalapeno and cheese, wow, uh, prices are pretty good. So you pay by the size of the burger here, so you've got like a 3 ounce, a 6 ounce or a 12 ounce. So I'm going to be going for a 6 ounce because I had a 12 ounce here before and it's been the only time that I've ever been beaten by a burger. It was a 12 ounce burger here at Buku's and you know, I've travelled extensively around America and you know, Land of the burger, never been beaten by a burger there, but I was beaten by a burger here. Nacho chili cheese, smokehouse squealer, wow. This is gonna take some consideration. Oh, an all day breakfast burger. <laughs> you can get some extra toppings. Should get that light out of it. Beer battered onion rings, oh nice. Louisiana hot buffalo wing sauce. Three chilies. Oh, look at that one. It's like roasted Naga ghost chili mustard. I don't think I'll be having that. I might do some chicken sandwiches as well. So we've got the grilled chicken, Cajun fried chicken. All right. Sides. Oh, tater tots. I don't really see them much in this country. Nice. So the drinks, you've got your sodas, your still drinks, hot beverages, beer, and some ciders, wine. Okay, so we've just handed our order in and they've given us a complimentary uh, like chip service here. So we'll, oh, is that that American creamy cheese? Oh. 
There's something so awful about that creamy cheese, that squidgy American creamy cheese, but I do love it. And that sauce is warm, which is the way it should be served. Perfect. Boy. Digging in, AJ. Good boy. I'm loving the decor in here. And some boots hanging from the ceiling. Love it. All right. I could see the bright side wearing a pair of those. Maybe that should be the gimmick of our channel. Maybe we should get some uh, cowboy boots. Amazing. What you got, Mama Bear? I have got Doritos Guava Pico, which oh. I think is Mexican. Yep. Um, and I thought I'd just try something a little bit different. Oh, okay. nice. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I've ever tasted that. No, but you can try some now. Oh, I suppose I could do. It's a good opportunity, isn't it? I'm loving the license plates there uh, embedded in the floor. New York license plate, Oregon, Missouri, pretty cool. Okay, nailed it. Okay, so we went for one side of fries because they're usually quite a big portion, so that's awesome. Yay! You've got your chicken tenders, you? Put some ketchup on. You've got your hot dog, little plain hot dog. <laughs> what was your burger? Um, I had the mushroom Swiss yep. with bacon. Nice, looks good. And I went for the cheesy bacon one with the onion rings as extra, so it's looking great. And it's served in a big tray, I like that. And we got a side of garlic mayo. How is it now that you're a little bit into it? Thumbs up? It's so juicy. Juicy, yeah. It's just dripping everywhere, but it's so tasty. <laughs> Absolutely worth it. And you went for a six ounce as well, didn't you? Yeah, because I think the 12 ounce is a bit of a monster. How are your chicken tenders? Good? <laughs> okay, so that was a really good burger. I do highly recommend coming to Buku's because if you like your burgers, this is the place to come locally. There is another Buku's in Falmouth. Um, I think there's only two, I believe. Uh, but we have this one here in Helston and one over across the way in, in Falmouth. So please, Buku's, come to Penzant. Just a point about the fries, they do dust them in like a, a paprika sort of mix. There's something else in there, a bit of salt you can taste. So if you're not struck on paprika, then yeah, you might want to ask them to hold the, the dusting of the fries. But luckily, I quite like it. It's 
a nice beer. Yeah, Goose Island. Tired boy. Because he would like a hat. Yeah, he wants one of the hats up there, doesn't he? So this place is usually really quite busy. Um, I would definitely re recommend making a reservation for sure. Hey Tilly, do you want some dessert? AJ, do you want some dessert? No. No? Really? Oh. So no trip to Buku's would be complete without an ice cream shake. So they have a huge amount to offer. You choose your flavor, you pick your size, you can customize it there. You can get all these toppings. Really good. Or of course, you have the specials where they're like pre-made. And, uh, well, that is looking amazing. I'm going to be going with, I think, I'm going to go with the Space Shake, because that looks delicious. We just put our milkshake order in, and I am super excited. This is what I'm going with, the Space Shake. So you've gone with some ice cream, Tilly, yeah? Yeah. All right, and here it is. Look at this. This is the space shake. It's got some Maltesers, and it's got um, what are those things called again? They're flying saucers, aren't they? Yes. Flying saucers. They're like sherbet-filled things, aren't they? Delicious. Oh yeah, can't wait. And I think the base ingredients were um, Mars Bar and Milky Way, and Space Shake. That's so good. Oh yeah. I got a build your own, and it is Reese's peanut butter cups with um, peanut butter m and Wow. Okay, go for it. Don't do enough peanut butter in this picture. No. <laughs> Your little shoulder dunks are going on. Yeah. Flying saucer. When did you last have a flying saucer? Oh, God. Do you want one? Oh, that sherbet's just hit you. <laughs> nice. Okay, so the bill's arrived, and you know, 56 pounds and change. Um, I think that's pretty good, really, for uh, the quality of the food that you get here. Just had a little taste of Shelley's um, Reese's peanut butter one. Yeah, if you like peanut butter, that's good. What did you think of mine? It just tastes like a chocolate milkshake. Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, that is uh, navigate the street a minute. That was delicious. Took my shake with me. I do highly recommend a burger at Buku's and a milkshake. We made it home about 40,000 calories later.
Yeah, you better most of mine is still in the fridge. Yeah. <laughs> As I say, you drank about half of your milkshake, I drank about three quarters of mine, and uh, you know, just in saved, the fridge. Saved it for later. Yeah. Uh, I got the meat sweaters there. Whew. You did. Mm -hmm. It's worth it. Well, I, I must say, I... What? I can't recommend Buku's enough. It's highly recommended, but absolutely do book, because it is only a little place. Yeah. Um, and it's really actually very popular because of what it does. Yeah, I was going to say, it's definitely not the biggest of the statues. If you want to go, do book. Yeah, yeah. I've never been to the one in Falmouth. I don't know if that's bigger. Um, no idea. Um, but I'm sure the quality is going to be of a similar sort of book. But I wouldn't... Yeah, I wouldn't put my name to that because I've never eaten it. Maybe we will. Maybe we will eat in the um, Farmer's Buku's and um, video it and I'll see. A Buku's tour, yeah. Anyway, I do hope you enjoyed the video. Do give it a big thumbs up. Do subscribe to the Bryce side. It really does help the channel grow. Hit the notification bell. You never miss it on any video that we put up. We are on social media. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram at the Bryce side. So, so do check us out there. So, from us to you, cheers, cheers and gone. gone.